and I'm like, oh my goodness, my brain like started to hurt. I said, I cannot imagine. Hi, it's Junk Journal in Jen. And I'm back with Painting Rocks. Okay, so a lot of these are just good to go. Okay, I'm just going to peek at a couple and touch them up just a smidgy and move them over to the done pile, okay? So let's use our brush here. A little bit of paint left. It's just like tiny. Little holes. Yay. Okay, that one's done. This one had just the edge. It was like the very edge. That one's done. Tiny hole. This one looks really good. Okay. This one's good. This one looks good. It's a little babe. It's such a beautiful day. Okay. So what's new? So we're going to um, sew some ruffles next. My shabby, chic, messy ruffles that I love to do. So I wrote that down today. And for the kit, we need to um, finish off our old mask making, those 144 pockets and tucks. You can go over to that, the mask making. So we're going to get back to that. So mask making and ruffles, that's where we're headed next. And I've already started on the next launch because every quarter I want to have something I launch. I don't want to, I don't necessarily need to launch something every month, but every um, quarter have a smart focus, smart business focus, right? So, yay, I'm excited about the rocks because they can go into everything I'm doing. Now the only sealant I've ever done on these is Mod Podge and I have never done it on the painted rocks, okay? I don't, I do not seal these. I've done them on the natural rocks, um, but I've only done regular Mod Podge. I've never tried outdoor or any weathering or anything like that. Um, Right now, we actually have a customer that um, is going to be using the rocks for outside, so we're testing some things. She tested something, and um, we're kind of still in discussion, like how it worked or what have you. So we'll see what happens with that. Um, so very interesting with the whole rock. Now, Mod Podge makes a outdoor i haven't used it yet i am going to test it because i think it's just smart to test it um i never knew they had one before until i got the plaid um boxing which i just received that like from this video like two weeks ago so i think it's been like two weeks so that's been interesting these turn out so good you guys That looks really great. The paint tone is just really awesome. Okay. A little dusty, dusty here. Oh, get off that one. This turned out good. Okay. So, that's where we're at. We're going to do some ruffles. The kits are coming out. Um... Probably probably Tuesday. 
I don't know. I'm not sure. I have friends help coming over to help me. I'm um, just put the last minute touches on them. That looks really good. Okay, this side was super light. I think this was the only one I was waiting to flip over. Cool. And then we'll move on to all of the colored rocks. All those little crevices there. Okay. The very edges, all around the edges. Fantastic. This little round rock has been so hard for me to paint because <laughs> it loves to move. There we go. Yeah, guys, all touched up. We are officially done with these gray rocks. I'm so happy because they took a lot of um, coats and my own fault mixing all that paint. Yay. So we're done. Yay. I'm going to cover this just in case, but I'm going to call it done. I'm going to move over here and see how our lighting is. Oh, that's going to be good. And we're going to finish off painting all these. And let's see. Pixie. So one side is gray. Those sides are done, so we're just doing this side now. This one we have to do. Let's flip these over so we're ready. Oh, there we go. That one we need to do. Oh, yep, yeah, this blue one's looking really good. We're going to go on this side now. That side. That side. Yep, that side. Ooh. Okay, we're already good there. He wanted me to repaint that one, period. Okay, so we're flipping on to the other side. Bam, bam, bam. Oh, that's going to be good. Okay, let's do this. Okay, guys, I'm back. You're gonna hear a little rumbling in the back because I'm making some coffee because I need to, uh, making some coffee because I need to make some paper, some special kind, so I have to make a special blend of coffee. It's a secret, I can't tell you my formula. Anyway, so I'm making some coffee, and this is the second coat to this little rock here, which I'm super excited about this color being done. I don't know what Ronnie's going to do on this one. So that one's done. Yay. Um, put that in here real quick, just to get a bulk of the paint off. Cool. Okay, let's go to the next one. We're going to do this light one real quick. This will be the second coat. And this was the Paradise. This color, so beautimous. Reminds me of the ocean. And this one was pretty good. It's just that I had um, put... Two coats on the other side, so I wanted to make sure I did the same on this side. That's quite a bit of paint, Jen. But I have lots of little crevices on this one. So I, <clears throat> I was uh, in the chat because I've been premiering my videos because I can't go live yet. You can't go live until you've had a 1,000 um, subscribers, right? And so I was in a premiere, and uh, one of my girlfriends, she's she's so faithful. She's just always in the chat. And um, her granddaughter asked her to do a soccer ball, and I'm like, oh, my goodness. My brain, like, started to hurt. I said, I cannot imagine. I guess her granddaughter found a perfect circle and um 
I'm like, oh my goodness, that just made my brain hurt. We did the like wonky dice, right? Um, that wasn't that hard to figure out because it had all the numbers, you know, like the sides. But my goodness, to sit there and figure out a soccer ball. Ooh, good luck. And I don't believe in luck. I believe in blessings. Okay, so now we're going to be done with these paints. Yay. Okay, so we got that one. That one's done. Let's move to this one here. Since we already have a blue-ish color going, right? So we'll do that one. And then we're going to do this blue. <clears throat> Yay! I just had a cup of coffee. A little cup of coffee, a little cup of java. I'm probably gonna end up giving up coffee all over again. Go back to tea. Or really, I should go back to my ginger root rosemary combo and things out of my garden because that would be really wise so isn't that good that we just only have a little bit to cover on this side guys love it and this color is the aqua I absolutely love the camera how it views so this is the camera on my phone I use my phone to video and I just love the camera on it, how it focuses when you need it to. I mean, now, granted, there are moments it doesn't want to focus. <laughs> We've all experienced that. And then I think I was watching, there's like this, I don't know. I, I feel like this guy's a brainiac. He knows everything about every new technology that's coming out so I always watch him and even the newer phones I mean again they upgraded the phone the uh camera all over again okay so that's good I'm gonna do this again see if we can get one more at least it takes some of the paint off yay because then we can move to that blue yeah Love it. We gotta get rid of this. And we still have pink, so we're good. That'll be our pink and our orange. And this is gonna be our silver. So we'll rinse that in a sec. One moment till. Okay, now this is came in blue. You know what else was a shocker today? I've had some videos that, um, I don't know, just didn't do as well in viewing, right? I mean, that happens whenever you do a new video. You kind of have to see how the views go, right? But when it came to this painting rocks, what I noticed today, because I just launched it today, hopefully I'll be posting this one tomorrow so they're, they're back to back. But um, the painting rocks, a lot of people have watched it already. I think they were very interested in the ruffles and rocks. And I don't know. Well, I'm going to have to see how this video does um, in 48 hours to see what I did. That makes it so different. Nice. Cool. So now we are done with the blue. Okay. And we're in it. I'm going to go rinse these, and we're going to do, um, I think we're going to go this way. Okay. We'll see what's up. You know me. I always change my mind. Be right back. Hi, guys. It's Junk Journal and Jen. I'm back. Okay. So, got the coffee. You know me. Got the coffee. And it's afternoon. And let's go ahead and get this done. Okay. All right. So, good, you can see good. Love this pink, love it, love it, love it. And because we already put our one coat, we don't need to put another one, so that's gonna be really great. 
yay. So this will be the end of the painting. And then I'll be able to show you guys the end result here shortly. Just finished our mass make. It ran into our Hmm. I know he wants this covered, but I don't think it's gonna do what he thinks it's gonna do. Well, let's see. Let's see if it covers. Oh, you guys, it covers. Well, kind of. Hmm, we'll see. Nice. We'll just see how that one goes. Pink is in the books. Done, Dada. Okay, and now we'll go to Salmon. We just finished doing, let me make sure I showed you this. This was the Seashell Pink. Salmon. Then we're gonna do gold and silver and be done. Let's pick this up. Not paint pretty. That is some pretty paint. Okay, I'm gonna scoop this up. There we go. So mass make is done. And now tonight I'm gonna be working on the kit some more. And it's almost done. I picked the papers which I showed that in my mass make video. And what else do we have to do? Oh, we're getting fabrics. Um, fabrics are already picked, they're already cut. Now I'm bundling them up, which that is gonna be so fun for you guys to see that. So fabrics. We'll be good to go. Okay, this side is gonna probably need two coats, I can tell. Okay, anything else we, we'll use peach, not peach, orange. Okay, sorry if you guys are hearing a lot of the dogs in the background. This is Vivid orange. There we go. Vivid orange. Now this one, remember we had to do like three coats, so three coats on this one. Just to get it to be that right coat that we wanted. Cisco, my boy. Sometimes my dogs sound like they're just eating their skin. <laughs> I know a lot of dogs have allergies, but sometimes ours just like, they get down with it. It's like, come on, man. <laughs> You're gonna hurt yourself. Okay. We'll do more coats of that one later. Let's mosey on down over here. Okay, so okay, let's do 
this is two gold. Two this gold. <clears throat> okay. Gold. Gold. That should be enough. Sorry for the tapping and your the loud tapping in your ear there, guys. This gold is really nice. Doesn't that look cool? Okay, so the next time you see these rocks, they are going to be done. So glad we didn't have that much to do. We'll have to put one more coat on that side. These are turning out really nice. Okay, so there's that. I'm gonna go there and then we'll do the yellow right now, which I think this was called crocus yellow. Mm hmm. Crocus yellow. It's a nice color, isn't it? I'm gonna have to think of something creative for Easter's coming. Okay, gold is done. Crocus yellow is done. Now we need to take on the silver. So let's do that. So I found out today a very interesting fact. I actually messaged, listen to this, this is major. I messaged StreamYard and to ask them a question about streaming and come to find out when you have StreamYard, you can stream live anywhere. Yep, anywhere. So I can stream to my YouTube right now and I don't even need a thousand followers. Isn't that something? I had no idea. So I'm gonna have to try that at some point. <laughs> now that I can fully do it, right? It's like, oh. I thought I had to get to a thousand. Here I've been like working it to get to a thousand. So now I could just go live now. So I think that's pretty cool. Now, after you go live, it now there's about, you know, your intro, your um, time for when people are waiting. In the lobby, what is your lobby music going to sound like? I mean, you could use YouTube's, but now you have your own, you know, you could do your own. So it's like a whole nother realm that I'm getting ready to learn again. You know me. I'm always learning something. Okay, purple, and then we are done, friends. We are done.
Now this is, now this is light lavender. Look at that. Light lavender. And that one's folk art. Let's lift this up for a second. Lift this up just a little bit. Almost looks like a heart. Right now it's upside down, but look, going that way. Okay. It's a big weekend in Vegas. I heard it's gonna be super busy. I know that um, one of my junk journaling friends, I just found out she's going to be out here. Um, and I believe her channel's name is uh, Free Spirit Art. Free Spirit Art. <clears throat> anyway, she was on my chat last night. And she was saying, Jen, I'm going to be out there over by Ikea. Oh, she's going to go to Ikea. So I was like, oh, cool. Okay. And I guess she used to live here. It's like, man, so many people have lived in Vegas, haven't they? Now, I can tell you all these things because she told me in chat. <laughs> right? Okay. I painted my cup. Anyways, we're done, guys. Yay. Happy brush. We're done. So that's it. That is it. I am excited. And I will be back in just a few minutes to show you the end result. Okay. So here they are. Here are some of our finished rocks. <laughs>